What is going on tonight, guys? Welcome back to the channel. This is episode two of tonight's drink. And uh, tonight we're gonna make something very special in honor of the Chinese New Year, which it's, Lisa, what is the year now? It's the year of the rabbit. You're so okay, cool. um, I was inspired by a friend of mine, shout out Tracy, who did some acupuncture on me recently. Nice. And we hit up some of the local Asian markets and that really inspired me to bring to Jay the idea of making a lychee martini. So what are lychees? Um, what is that? So lychee right here, we actually just grabbed the canned lychee. It's like a tropical peeled grape slash pear is kind of what you get out of it. Let's see if we can show them what it looks yeah, like. Yeah, sort of. they're like these little round balls, you know, they have a pit or whatever. These are already cleaned out, which is really nice in the can. Yeah. So we're gonna use those and they come in a light syrup. So that's really helpful for making the drink. So, um, you know, you may wanna just go with the can for this purpose anyways. Correct. So I guess let's get started on this All right. Sounds delicious good. drink, honey. A lychee martini, right? Is lychee that what we're calling martini. it? Lychee martini. Okay. So we're gonna start out with a couple of these little guys and we're gonna muddle them up in the shaker. Should we do two or three? What do you think? Yeah, I mean, two is good okay. if you just get them real yeah. mashed in there, I and think. Get your little handy dandy muddler or use whatever kind of spoon you got to kind of mash them down and just muddle them up. Basically. I think, so we tested this a couple times already today <laughs> and um, we found that if you mash it up really good, like little pieces kind of get into the drink mm -hmm. and it makes it really, really delectable. Nice. That's this is good. really going to be good for Valentine's Day too, because it's kind of like sweet and tropical. Yeah. Okay. Romantic, I can see that. you know. Yes. Martinis. Look, we got our cute little glasses here right. too. All right. So we've muddled in two lychees. Right. Now we're going to throw in the ice, and then everything else, or ice last. Um, I think you can go ahead and throw in the ice now, okay. honey. All right. so I don't think it matters ice. either way, but it starts to chill everything, right? Yeah. So. Yeah. Absolutely. And then uh, vodka. We're going with uh, my old standby. Little Tito's. It's good stuff. It works. <laughs> Seems to be really popular these yeah, days. Yeah, it's not too exorbitant. It's good stuff. So we've got like the one and a half jigger here, and we decided, right. you know, you got to go over the line. You got to go to the top, Just right? So we're putting in a couple of those, and this is going to be for both of ours. Right, so this is for two, two drinks. Two martinis. Yeah, although you could drink this all. I yeah, could, you I could, could drink it all myself. You could probably quadruple myself. this and yeah. still want to drink them all. Okay, vodka's in. Okay, uh, so now we are muddled. The juice, the syrup. Right, like it's just sugar, syrup. water, in with the fruit. I'm getting really thirsty, you know. Well, that happens when we're going to make a delicious juice. What I've recently learned is it takes a long time to set up these shots. So um, kudos to our cameraman here that really has <laughs> gone the extra mile to try to even teach me a little bit about this along the way. So here we My go. Pleasure. My pleasure. Thank you. Okay, two of those. Okay, so two one ounce of the lychee syrup from the can. Right. And then we're just gonna add one more of this. Simple syrup. Yeah, we can just pour it in here, don't you think? Yeah, oh yeah. Let's Absolutely, just, go ahead. Let's just pour it in there. There you are. And I can't even tell by look the looks of this that this is a, a bit thicker of a syrup, you know, our simple syrup that we made here at the house. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the, the last ingredient is lime. So, I don't know, what's that, like about a third of a lime? I'd go Quarter, ahead and third. squeeze that whole thing in there. Yeah. Okay. I really like lime. I don't know if you do. Let us know if you do in the comments. Yeah. But I always say a little bit extra. We kind of ran out of the fresh lime, but luckily we had a little bit extra. Always keep here. some of that in your fridge and lemon juice just in case, you know what I mean? A little backup. Yeah, throw a couple extra squirts in there, babe. There we go. I think that's solid. All right, that's that looks good. Yeah. All right, so this is like the fun part, right? It sure is. This is where you like get those big muscles that you have, right. honey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure this thing doesn't go flying. <laughs> Yeah, and while he's doing that, I'm gonna get the snacks ready. So when I went to the Asian market, we got all these like wonderful little tree. It's these nuts right here that I ate in Thailand. Some other stuff, some chips. These are like lime chips. 
that they're are lays, lays but from like in Asia. Japan. Yeah. yeah, I think they're Japanese. That's crazy. And then these like fun pineapple cakes. Anyways, so Good are we stuff. shook up? We're ready to go. Is it a shake, rattle, and roll on the Lichi Martinez? Absolutely. I'm gonna get these chips ready to have with them. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, this this one looks like a keeper right here. And it's so smooth, you don't hardly even taste the vodka at all. It's just deliciousness. That's all I can say. Oh, and throw one of those um, oh, lychees right in, there. in there. Yeah, for garnish. It. To make it really, really cute. Just to top it off, you know. It's a martini after all. We're not doing olives in this one, so may as well do a piece of fruit. Yeah, it's really reminiscent of olive. I didn't think of that before. Mm -hmm. So if you're ready Here for a, a different martini tonight, yeah. this is tonight's drink. Salud. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. It's delicious. It's super refreshing. I'm gonna try it with one of these lime chips here. Go for it. Mm -hmm. Good job, us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? Oh, yeah, I'm getting out the pineapple cakes to go with this too. Yeah. But thanks everybody. Yeah, try this drink out. Let us know what you think about it. Um, again, it's very sweet and refreshing, tropical. It's not too, you know, too uh, alcohol tasting. It's just delicious. They go down really well. And uh, might be fun for a party. Might be fun for Valentine's Day, whatever. Or so. just to hang out and try something different one night. Mm -hmm. If you're doing like an Asian-inspired dinner, stir-fry, something like that. Delish. <laughs>